guys, welcome back. I hope you're doing great. I cannot wait to share today's DIY project with you. I recently saw this trio of gold leaf candle holders at Z Gallery for about $40. And today I spent $6 at Dollar Tree and I think mine turned out pretty darn close. And for the price, you just can't beat it. So you will need three of the small glass fishbowl candle holders they sell, along with the small, medium, and large pedestal tea light holders. All right, so you can buy gold leaf and really go for the genuine look, but I really wanted something easier and cheaper. So I'm using my metallic gold spray paint by Krylon. And here is the trick. You wanna go ahead and spray your glass down quickly with the gold paint and then right away spray it with vinegar or a vinegar water solution. I used like three parts white vinegar to one part water and just mist that all over really quickly on there and then get right in there with a cloth or paper towel or something and blot it and just keep pressing and tapping all over the glass to remove the excess. You can give it a little while to sit and dry in between coats, but you might want to do a couple more times. Same thing, quick gold spray all over, then right away a quick spray all over with the vinegar solution, and then dab the paper towel all over again, so you'll kind of get that blotchy effect. And I thought this worked really well. The key was to do the vinegar spray right after the spray paint, because even waiting like 30 seconds, the paint starts drying on there quickly. So have both ready to go. Paint, white vinegar, and then a rag to blot it dry, and it will give you that antiqued gold leaf effect. So while the glass globes are drying, remove the tags and stickers from the tea light holders. Cool water definitely works the best, especially if you can let them soak for five, 10 minutes first. The cold water just kind of like helps the glue ball up and come off much more quickly than hot water, which just made it get stickier and glueier, if you know what I mean. So go with the cool water. It will be so much easier. And it's so much easier to get them clean thoroughly now rather than wait until after you've finished assembling your candle holders. So now for the assembly, I'm doing little bits of E6000 glue around the top edge of the tea light holder and then little bits of hot glue in between as well to give it a, a quick hold so nothing slides around here. It's probably best to give the E6000 a full day to dry completely if you can, but really the assembly time overall was really quick and easy for these. And considering they cost a small fraction of what the original Z Gallery ones do, I think they turned out pretty close. They're unique and beautiful and could go perfectly with your decor throughout the year and probably even over the holidays as well. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you all soon in the next one. Bye guys.